hello guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are going to see how you can download any image and pdf in your flutter so let's start with our demo app so for now we'll start our application so for the initial i will tell you what you have to do is go to foxbox spec go to pop.dev and copy this dependencies which is fi downloader go to installing copy these dependencies okay once you have copied what you can do is for android you can paste these dependencies here and install it in your system and then for the android what you can do is you can go to your filter cradle inside your app here and inside that you can set your compiled sdk version 234 so make the compiled sdk version 234 and one more thing you need to do is go to build cradle and make sure that your kotlin version is up to date or greater than this okay and for the ios what you can do is go to your ios go to runner go to info pierced and you need to paste these instructions here you can find these instructions in the readme section here ios simply copy this files and paste it here okay so now once you have installed your this dependencies into your system we have our app bar let the application run uh, for progress we have took progress equal to zero and we have declared our stream subscription as a progress stream and for now i have one dummy pdf here url and an image url you can see this is our image that we are going to download so for now we have our application up and running so this is our simple ui where i have this progress where you will just show the progress of your downloading and the button which we will use to download our file okay so at start what you can do is inside init so inside init state what you can do is you can initialize your downloaded first okay so you have to initialize this first and then for downloading you need to listen to the progress that is our progress stream equal to file downloader dot we get the progress stream and we can listen to the event okay so which event so we can listen to the event dot status is equal to our download status dot if it's successful what you can do is we can simply get the progress we can use the set state progress which is our progress is equal to our event dot progress okay and when it's successful you can also you open the file you can open the file using directly using the file downloader uh, how is you can use file downloader dot open file so you have this open file and here we need to give the file path and we can get this path from our event dot file path okay 
so this will be the path that of our file that is getting downloaded and it will open automatically once it's downloaded successfully we have other status as well we can use else if our even dot status is equal to download status dot if it's running then also we can set our progress is equal to even dot progress and else if if we have any errors we can also check that even dot status is equal to our download status download status dot if we have any error or if it's failed we can do some operations here okay so this will be our init state also don't forget to dispose our stream we can dispose our stream that is progress stream dot cancel okay so let's just save our application for now so this is the initial process that you have to write and in the on press property of our button what we can write inside our on progress so we can check the permission as well let's say we have a permission is equal to l downloader dot we can see the request for the permission and now we can check if our permission is equal to our download permission or storage permission status dot granted if it is granted okay then what we can do is we can simply get our url that is dot download and here we need to pass the url for example we can use a wait to check the permission and now here the url will be our file url that is this is our pdf file url and this is our file image url okay so we first we can try by passing our image so we have passed our image url we'll save our application so we'll hot restart our application so that everything will get initialized first <coughs> so now it's ready so now we will click on our download button okay so now we have clicked our download button we can see the progress and our file is <coughs> downloaded as you can see this is our file we can even get this download notification you can see okay now we will see our pdf file we will open our application now we will change our pdf file to the file file pdf url so what you can do is you can also give the file name as well let's say we can give it the file name of test okay and let's just save the app 
we'll hot restart our application again so now we have our pdf url and a name for our pdf which is test so let's click on our download the progress is 100 percent we got the notification and our file will get open it will ask us to open so here is our file in downloads which is test we can click on this test and we can see that this is our pdf that is downloaded right now okay we'll go back back to our application so this is how you can use these dependencies plugin inside your flutter application to download any images and pdf url using urls so hope you found this video helpful do like share subscribe to my channel for more such videos and see you in the next video